What's up guys, we're back with Jex. Today, we've got another full day of raiding. It is currently 9.40 in the morning. We're about to head out. I've got two goals for today. My goal for today is to try and get my second perfect legendary bird. And my second goal for today is I've got this nice collection of 10k eggs that I want to finish hatching because it's been a while but you didn't see my last 10k egg hatches I haven't done egg hatching uh, on my videos for a little while I have hatched one set of 10k eggs which are here I'm just gonna take you rating this is such a big part of the game now uh, it's really fun we're getting lots of people together Getting out of the house, meeting new people, taking on these raid bosses together. Let's go! So we're on our way to Double Lugia Articuno at the Broadwater. Uh, we made a quick pit stop for a Machamp and someone Yay! got Yay! a perfect Machamp. <laughs> and also we've got our driver Dan here. <laughs> Still doesn't have an Articuno. He's had three shots, missed three shots? Two shots. Two shots. Two shots, missed both of them. So uh, hopefully we can get him an Articuno today. Good start to the day. Well, we just smashed out Lugia, Lugia Articuno, and our, our boy here, Dan, finally got his first Articuno. Woo! We've just checked the maps. We've got a Lapras and a Machamp at the Art Center. Once again, Dan doesn't have a Lapras <laughs> and he's the driver, so we're off to the Art Center. Well, I didn't get the chance to do a recap because my camera battery died and my phone got full, but Dan did manage to get his Lapras and I'm here now editing the video that you're watching and I realized to myself how close I was to actually hitting level 40. So, I'm on 4,985,064. It's not even 15,000 less. But I'm contemplating what I'm going to do special. I don't have my starter Pokemon. I can't evolve that to hit level 40. Um, I got a suggestion that shiny... Oh, Evolving shiny. Um, I don't have a shiny Pikachu, but I don't have my red Gyarados yet, so that's something I may do. I'm really going to decide tomorrow morning. But the other thing that I wanted to point out is that I also have finally hit my 1 million Stardust. So I'm going to be doing some powering up of some MVPs. We're still currently a week out from Legendaries being over. But I figured to myself, there's no harm in powering up a few choice Pokemon um, that I've been really looking forward to powering up. But anyway, I'm going to finish um, editing this video. Well, I'm not going to finish editing this video. I'm going to be doing as much as possible. Hit my level 40 tomorrow, which still deciding on how I'm going to do it. And then, well, I'll see you then. Let's get to it. <laughs> right, so I had a lot of thought about it. 
and I've decided that I'm going to be trying to solo a Machamp tier 3 raid boss by myself. Obviously, that's what solo is. Uh, I also apologize about the wind noise. Um, I'm here back on the broad water. It's kind of reminiscent of, this is where I've done a lot of my videos in the past. So, kind of feels special. I got a little bit of construction work going on around me here. Like, you can see, they've cornered off the whole place to rejuvenate the garden or something like that. Uh, I found a raid. Uh, I am currently at 4,995,992. I get 4,000 experience from the raid boss, which will tip me just under. So I need to beat this raid boss and kill it, and I will be finally level 40. Let's uh, let's try and solo this Machamp. So I've obviously powered up a couple of Pokemon ready for this. Um, I won't go through them all, I'll show them all at the end of the video. But this is exciting, this is, oh my goodness. Cool, so it started off with Lugia, uh, it started off with this Dragonite, which has Hurricane, which is obviously ideal. Uh, Espeon, awesome. Uh, the other one I've got here, got Executor. So, double psychic move executor. Ah, actually, more importantly, let's chuck Alakazam into the mix, and I'm going to swap it out for my second one, because Alakazam is obviously the best choice in regards to DPS. And for my last one, I don't really have anything ideal for a six. Um... So, I think I'm going to pick... Probably just pick Gengar, just in case. Oh, I can feel it. This has been so long. So much playing. Yes. Ah, oh, four thousand experience. All the bonuses except gym control, because the valid gym. What CP we got? Sixteen thirty-three. I'm pretty sure this should be a ninety-one percent champ. All right, I'm gonna be greedy. I'm gonna pin up it because. My chop candy is always good. Probably left that circle a bit too round, so spinning the ball, getting the circle nice and small, releasing it, and it will stay that size. When I go to start again, fight, swing, connect. Excellent throw. Come on, give me the pin up. Come on, fight, attack. Ah, 
Oh. Hey, hey. All right, here we go. Not even gonna check its ID first. Tick that. Level 40. Oh. Oh. Oh, so good. Well, I hit it. And then I'm gonna keep raiding for the rest of the day. Because we still have one week left of the legendary birds. I still only have one legendary bird. Uh, those 10k eggs that I was going to hatch, I did. They were terrible. So I'm not even gonna bother putting them in. Thanks everyone for watching this video. Um, please like, subscribe if you haven't yet. Uh, in my next video, I'm going to be overpowering some of these Pokemon. Uh, stay tuned for what that is. And I'll see you guys next time.